Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the report from Tiger Mountain. We're going to talk about COVID-19 as economic catastrophe uh, tonight on tonight's show. So stick around and take a listen. This whole year has been a deliberate economic catastrophe cast upon Western civilization and Western nations. Stick around and listen. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the report from Tiger Mountain. We're going to talk about... Um, this year, I mean, obviously there's been a huge hysteria about COVID-19 and, um, you know, it's been the uh, major talking point of the year, probably since the beginning of the year, when it first began to appear and we began to worry whether, whether it was coming our way. Obviously, a couple of months later, we found out that it certainly was coming our way, thanks to China. And, um, you know, I mean, the whole point, though, has been has been not a kind of reaction to this disease, which has actually got a very low um, death rate, which is only about 1%. Very similar to the flu, maybe a strong flu. We could, we could grant that it's a strong flu. Um, but, you know, the whole point has been the economic um, the lockdowns the the kind of impositions put upon business impositions put upon every part of our lives you know I mean that's the whole point of 2020 has been this incredible um, medical tyranny um, that's been the point of 2020 um, you know and that's in a way this uh, whole uh, coronavirus COVID-19 thing has just been the trigger that um, like enters us into this world and obviously there's already the globalist elite and the international elite class already linking COVID-19 to what they call the Great Reset. And if you think it's a conspiracy, check out the new cover of Time magazine which features uh, a cover, the Great Reset, already um, linking things like COVID-19 and, and the reaction to this crisis um, to uh, climate change. You've got to remember that like what many of us have experienced who've been in radical lockdown, I'm in Melbourne, we just got out of uh, radical lockdown here, um, the shops reopened, it's a bit quiet but uh, the shops have reopened life has begun to return to normal but like you know that's been the whole point of this year um you know it's almost like the climate change dream or whatever the climate change um thing of like shutting down western um uh capitalism that has, has actually been achieved this year with COVID-19 and you can see the elite are absolutely tickled pink about this and they want to continue that um with their climate hysteria which is also like COVID-19 it's an over exaggeration there is obviously human beings that are polluting the planet and we can clean this up and we can do this in a right-wing manner that doesn't involve shutting down all our economies and shutting down all our businesses but you can see this tremendous grab for power that's going on and is being led from the world world economic forum where you just look that up look up world economic forum and you'll see exactly what's going on um, in relation to this um, so there's been a direct connection um, through uh, medical tyranny uh, that they're now moving to kind of climate control tyranny and they don't want to let us go they don't want to they want to keep this pressure on to um, keep this kind of um, you know boot stomping on the human face forever which is the um, you know dream, well, the dream of 1984. I mean, there's a reason 1984 has been such a popular novel because it's been so spot on, and it's because George Orwell worked in intelligence, ladies and gentlemen, uh, during World War II, and he was privy to what the globalists wanted to do, their eventual end game, and we're now there, or at least we're at the outskirts of, of you know of them bringing in their 1984 nightmare. So you know, this is what we're we're dealing with. We're dealing with um, you know a COVID crisis that has been way over exaggerated, so that we're all locked down. So sort of in, in Victoria here we had, we had a we had a curfew from 9 p.m. till dawn I don't know how that affected the virus it had nothing to do with actual medical advice that was just a decision you know through this medical tyranny and that is the whole point of all this a medical tyranny I mean you know let's just drop the medical tyranny is the whole point of this and this is a global grasp for power by a group of people who are interested in tyrannizing over the entirety of humanity and you know we must fight it so we must make videos like this and there are many many uh, independent um, news sources and alternative news sources all over the web and this is just one of many voices but uh, hopefully it contributes to waking people up and um, them resisting this um, you know slow uh, and quick slide into a kind of um, tyranny uh in the 21st century so it's a great scandal and i just wanted to raise that point and have your thinking about that tonight on the report from tiger mountain